What are university officials waiting on? What do they need to see before they stand up to these terrorist sympathizers? And that is exactly what they are. What's worse, though, is that Columbia's choice to ignore the safety of their Jewish students and appease anti-Semites has inspired even more hate-filled protests to pop up across the country. And what we're seeing right now is people wave Hezbollah flags and, and Hamas flags, their homemade signs supporting what happened on October 7th. It's outrageous. Hamas endorsed the protest at Columbia University just about uh, two hours before we walked out on the steps to have our press event on Wednesday. They're proudly chanting things like death to America and, and profanity and, and hate-filled slogans. And this is utterly despicable, and it cannot be accepted in this country. Anti-Semitism is a virus. And because the administration and woke university presidents aren't stepping in, we're seeing it spread. We have to act. And House Republicans will speak to this fateful moment with moral clarity. We really wish those in the White House would do the same. We will not allow anti-Semitism to thrive on campus, and we will hold these universities accountable for their failure to protect Jewish students on campus. And that's why today we're here to announce a housewide effort to crack down on anti-Semitism on college campuses.
Every department that we call here, God bless you guys.